Hey guys, in this video, I will show you how you can fix a uh, Riot client not opening after launch. So in this video, I will show a couple of solutions and without further ado, let's get started. So first of all, you just need to find your Riot client uh, shortcut and you just need to right click on it, go to uh, properties and then you just need to go to compatibility. And here, first, what you need to do here is to press this button that says run compatibility troubleshooter, right? And if you have some problems, it will be listed here. But if it's not, as you can see here, you're good to go. And another thing that you can do here, you can check this box, run this program in compatibility mode four, and you just need to uh, select latest version of Windows here as you can see here and make sure run this program as administrator and if you're running this program as, uh, as administrator as well um, and the right client do not work then uncheck this box and then press apply and okay and then you need to look if the problem persists uh, or not and another thing that you can do here you can open up a task manager as you can see here and what you need to do here is to close all the programs related to Riot Client, Riot Vanguard, uh, Valorant, League of Legends, and all the stuff here, and uh, close on your system tree as well. And then try to uh, re-enter Riot Client and see if the problem uh, persists uh, or not. And if the problem persists, then the uh, other option that I, uh, I can suggest you is on search, you can write check for updates and you need to look if there is an update on your operating system that you need to download and install and if there is uh, please download and install and restart your computer and it basically uh, it, and this can cause the problem and if the problem persists and you do uh, all these steps uh, the last thing that you can do here is to uninstall antivirus uh, programs maybe you have third-party uh, antivirus programs like Avast, uh, uh, Kaspersky, uh, McAfee or AVG and you just need to uh, uninstall them because it can cause uh, the problem and to do so uh, what you need to do here you need to go to control the panel and then you need to go to programs and features here and here you just need to locate the antivirus program and uninstall it and restart your computer and it can uh, basically solve the problem right so that's pretty much it and if i help you out please press like button and subscribe for more take care bye